and I will factor out the a squared in the denominator. So integral is equal to a second squared theta d theta. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and believe. Know what I want. So I'll take Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel Mathematic TV. So today is another tutorial day. So now I'm going to talk about the formula that we used last time in integrating inverse trigonometric functions, which is the integral of dv over the square root of a squared minus b squared is equal to arc sine of v over a plus c. And the second one is the integral of dv over this is supposed to be a squared plus v squared is equal to 1 over a arctan of v over a plus c. So now, I will provide a solution for these uh, integrals using a trigo substitution. So let's go. First, I will integrate the integral of dv over the square root of a squared minus b squared. So using a trigo substitution, I will put v is equal to a sine theta. So v squared is equal to a squared sine squared theta. And dv is equal to a cosine theta, the derivative of sine theta. So multiply by b theta. Now I will input this value into the integral. Therefore, the integral is equal to dv, which is a cosine theta d theta. A cosine theta d theta over square root of a squared minus b squared, which is here. So this is a squared sine squared now. So we can simplify this into the integral of a cosine theta d theta over I will factor out the a squared. So factoring a squared. So a squared times 1 minus I mean the square root of a squared multiplied by the square root of 1 minus sine squared theta. And notice that the square root of a squared is equal to a. So it means this will be cancelled. So anyway, 1 minus sine squared theta is equal to cosine squared theta using the um, trigonometric identification since sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta is equal to 1. So cosine squared theta is equal to 1 minus sine squared theta so I will plug in the value of 1 minus sine squared theta here so to be easy to integrate this is um, I will input the identities of 1 minus sine squared theta so integral now is equal to cos theta d theta per d square root of cosine squared theta and the square root of cosine squared theta is equal to cosine theta. So the integral is equal to cosine theta d theta over cosine theta now. So it means this will be cancelled also. Therefore, the integral now is equal to d theta, which is equal to theta plus c. Anyway, what is the value of theta? Let's go back to the first equation. It is b is equal to a sine theta. Okay, since v is equal to a sine theta, I will get the value of sine theta by dividing both sides by a. And this will be cancelled. So sine theta is equal to b over a. Hence, theta will be equal to inverse of sine v over a so to get the final answer you need to input what is the value of theta here so our final answer is theta which is arc sine of v over a so arc sine 
of V over A and don't forget to add the constant of integration. So this is our final answer. Hence, we prove that the integral of dv over d squared of a squared minus v squared is equal to arcsine of v over a plus c. And this is the solution. Now, let's proceed to the second formula. So, which is the integral of dv over a squared plus v squared. So, again, using try to substitution, I will put v equal to a tan theta so v squared is equal to a squared tangent squared theta and dv is equal to a so what is the derivative of tan theta second squared theta v theta now i will input this value into the integral so this is equal to the integral of dv which is here. So a second squared theta d theta over a squared plus v squared. So what is the value of v squared? So here's the v squared. So the v squared is equal to a squared tangent squared theta. So this is equal to a squared tan squared theta. And I will factor out the a squared in the denominators. So integral is equal to a second squared theta d theta over a squared times 1 plus tan squared theta. And notice that the a will be cancelled. And 1 over a is just a constant, so we can put that before the integral sign. Therefore, the integral is equal to 1 over a integral of second squared theta d theta over 1 plus tan squared theta. And notice that 1 plus tangent squared theta is equal to second squared theta. So this is equal to 1 over a integral of second squared theta d theta over second squared theta using the trigo identities. So if I put a um, value of 1 plus tangent, tangent squared theta equal to second squared theta, so it will be easy to integrate because this will be cancelled. Hence, the integral now is equal to 1 over a integral of d theta, which is equal now to 1 over a times theta plus c. And, and let's go back to the first equation in order to get the value of theta. So since v is equal to a tan theta, tan theta is equal to v over a. And theta is equal to the inverse of tan v over a. Now, to get the final answer, you need to input what is the value of theta into the answer. So, it means our final answer will be 1 over a times theta, which is here. So, times arctan of v over a plus c. So, this is our final answer. And again, we proved the formula for the arctan, which is the integral of dv over d squared over a squared plus v squared rather that equal to 1 over a arctan of v over a plus c. So this is the solution or the proof that the integral of dv over a squared plus v squared is equal to 1 over a arctan of v over a plus c. Anyway, in my next video, I will uh, make a tutorial for the integral or how to integrate using a trigo substitution. So stay tuned. Alright, that's all for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. And please share your thoughts about it by commenting below. And if you learned something today, please give this video a thumbs up. And also if you want to see the other videos, link in the description below. 
and please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Stay tuned and see you on my next video. Thanks and God bless. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it up in some work and believe. Know what I want, so I'll take it on. I've made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong.